Yo, what up, Kenny Bogus? Taste this. Yo, welcome to another exciting adventure at Kenny's Kitchen with your boy Young Kitchen. That will be me. And yo, this week, we about to hit y'all with something special. We're gonna hit you with the chicken fajita quesadilla done righteously, as we always do. Right here, right now. Taste this. Church. Let's go. Okay, so getting started with these fajita quesadillas, what we got here is about like two to three pounds of, uh, you can get either boneless, skinless chicken breast or chicken thighs. I uh, chopped up some chicken breast into little cubes. And then I got some peppers, got some red peppers, some yellow peppers. You can get some green, you can do whatever you want. And uh, then we got the magic. I got, uh, you can get you some taco seasoning, from the packer, you can make your own, and that's what I did. And to make that, it's real simple. What I did is I took uh, two tablespoons of chili powder, uh, a tablespoon of adobo seasoning, uh, half a teaspoon of onion powder, half a teaspoon of garlic powder, fourth a teaspoon of cayenne pepper, fourth a teaspoon of crushed red pepper, half a teaspoon of uh, dried oregano, two tablespoons of ground cumin, uh, half a teaspoon of smoked paprika, uh, one teaspoon of kosher salt, and two uh, teaspoons of fresh ground black pepper. Right? So, first let's go to the pan and get busy on this chicken. All right, next we get a nice big skillet, get you two tablespoons of cooking oil, and we're about to have a party in the pan. We're gonna take those chicken breasts that I cut up, cubed up, Dump them right in the middle, like so. Grab my little spatula, spread them out. Turn the heat down. I started on a high heat, but I just turned it down to like a medium. It kind of, being that the pan was kind of screaming, I didn't want them to stick. So I'm hitting them with another little Light salt. Light pepper, about a teaspoon a piece, just to get a little something going in those things. And then we're gonna cook them and kind of move them around until the pink is out of there. Which only takes a couple minutes and then we're gonna start adding the rest of the seasoning, our taco seasoning uh, blend. And that's pretty quick. So once the pink is, it's still a little bit of pink left, but that's fine. We're gonna take our uh, seasoning and kind of evenly distribute it. Across said chicken. And keep stirring it up. About a couple more minutes, probably about maybe three to four minutes total before we start adding the other ingredients to the party. So, so yeah, we keep it moving it around, keep moving it, like I said, until the paint gets out of there, a couple minutes. I think we're about there. Got a little juice to the side, and then I'm gonna start adding the peppers. Add the red and the yellow. And then we can stir those up a little bit. We actually can, um, add the remainder of the season. I saved a little bit for the veggies and give that a little quick little toss stir. I like to let them go to the side by themselves, get a little sweat on them, and then incorporate them into your chicken. Like so, pretty, pretty. All right, let's switch pans and get to the tortillas. All right, so in a, uh, a separate pan, skillet, whatever, what have you, you take another a tablespoon and a half of oil, put it in there, let it bring it to a nice little heat, heat, heat. Well, it's ready, ready, ready. And uh, we're gonna take a, a flour tortilla. Drop the boy right in the middle, right? It's medium heat, so we're gonna take a little, uh, I got a little Mexican blend cheese. You can use whatever cheeses you want, the cheddar, but I got a Mexican blend. I'm gonna spread a little bit out. on like one side. And I also found this uh, 
this thick cut cheese I wanted to try. Good for melting. It's a cheddar cheese. It's just a mild cheddar. I like I like it cheesy, baby. Just put a little bit on there, and then we're gonna add our uh, chicken fajita quesadilla filling on top of that. Just like that. And we're gonna add a little bit more cheese to the top. You can't you can't go extra cheese this thing. I don't believe. Okay, extra cheese, and then we're gonna flip that boy. And basically, that entails this. We fold it over to like a half moon. This, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, is the flip. All right, y'all. I think y'all know what time of day it is. The chicken fajita quesadilla. Kenny's kitchen style right here on Taste This, baby. Oh, yeah. Let's go ahead and do that thing. Let's zoom on in for y'all. Slight little zoom. Oh, man. Pretty man, golden brown. Let's zoom on out. Yeah. Again, chicken fajita quesadilla. Done righteously on Taste This, man. We appreciate y'all for subscribing. Keep telling your peoples and your people's people to keep on doing that thing. Hitting that subscribe button for us. And uh, keep checking us out on all the social media uh, platforms we got. You know, whether it's uh, tasteus.com, whether it's IG, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Check us out. We got big things coming. And man, we'll see y'all next week. It's all about flavor, baby. Chach. All right, people, I'm about to get up out of here. Hope y'all enjoy the chicken pita quesadillas on Kitty's Kitchen. You know how we do. Hopefully, man, you never know. You might see them on our, uh, we're getting our uh, catering menu together. You might see them on there. So who knows, man? But stay tuned. Keep subscribing, telling your people. You know what I always say. It's all about flavor, baby. See you next week. Chach. We out. Till next week. Later. One.